huge outpouring of support from our viewers after we told you about a couple who became victims in a crash. Thanks for joining us. I'm Dave Corvassier. And I'm Paula Francis. The couple visited Las Vegas to get married, but their plans are on hold for now with a focus on recovery. Vanessa Murphy is in the newsroom with an update to their story tonight. Vanessa. Dave and Paula, this wedding trip took a tragic turn, and from the comments we saw on Facebook and the Family's GoFundMe page, some Las Vegas locals feel terrible this happened to people visiting our town and wanted to help. What do we do? We do. <laughs> Anthony Alston and his fiance Ashley Swift were hurt in this crash on Interstate 15 near downtown Las Vegas Saturday evening. They were headed to a helicopter ride when police say a drunk driver collided with the shuttle van they were passengers in. Anthony told us Tuesday he was grateful for drivers who stopped to help him lift the van to help free Ashley who was trapped. Thank you. I appreciate you because I felt like I was by myself. Just thank you, and God bless y'all. And the people of Southern Nevada have continued to reach out to the Kentucky couple after Anthony and Ashley's father revealed her arm point. had to be amputated. They point. also opened up about other challenges Continue the couple will face side. moving forward. I got to be here until I take my child home. And he's, he's going to be here until he takes his fiance home. On Facebook, shares and messages from 8 News Now viewers like Clark County bemoans the horror of drunk driving, prayers for their family. On their GoFundMe page, donations and kind words. I am sorry this happened to you. Las Vegas is full of caring and lovely people. Wishing you a quick recovery. God bless. I saw your story on the news. My heart goes out to you. And one woman said she and her husband came to Vegas in 2007 to get married too. We loved it so much. We moved here in 2011. My heart cries for you and your family. Anthony says he plans on going through with that wedding once Ashley is well enough. I'm here for no matter what. Our plans are still going to remain. The family says they do not know when Ashley will be able to head back to Kentucky because she's been in and out of surgery. She's recovering from multiple injuries, not just that amputation. And the couple's 11-month-old child is being cared for by family in Kentucky. Tonight, almost $8,000 have been raised for Ashley. We've posted information on how you can help on our website at LasVegasNow.com. Reporting live in the newsroom, Vanessa Murphy, 8 News Now. Vanessa, you got a status update for us on that accused drunk driver? Well, Dave, the Henderson resident, his name is Orlando Gunn, remains in the Clark County Detention Center on felony DUI charges. Nevada Highway Patrol tells us a total of 13 people were hurt in that crash. Back to you. Wow. All right. Thanks, Vanessa. Mm -hmm.